Hello there guys, it's Bo42 here and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Sonic Lost World. In the last episode we completed Tropical Coast and defeated Master Zek, which was very annoying because of the stinking rocket wisp. Oh my lord. I mean it might be my fault because I wasn't like aiming before I used it, but still. That was annoying. Anyways, in this episode we're gonna be uh, going to Frozen Factory. I'm not since levels are really seriously getting gradually longer, uh, I might just stop at the halfway point here. Alright, so, uh, now in this level you can't spin dash on the ice. I don't know why, maybe it gives Sonic frostbite on his back or something like that. Who knows? <laughs> While you're running, it does like make him have this really graceful jump. I like it. It's so graceful. <laughs> I can do it all day. Oh man, I didn't want to go there. I wanted to go up there. Ugh. have much... Oh, come on. That's bull crap. Now, I don't really have much to say about this world. It's not my favorite. Nerds! What? I don't have any rings. That's bull crap. Um... Let's see here. I don't really think there are any memorable levels, except for one in this world that I kind of like. section. Well, I got nothing there. Huh. Nothing in particular, really. Oh, there's another one. Cool. Alright. Oh, I am awesome at avoiding spikes, balls. Alright. There's a bell over there. I don't really feel like getting that. Because there are these guys. I don't know what those guys are called, but they're like in almost every Sonic game. Almost every Sonic game. Yeah. I don't like them because. <laughs> Especially these fiery ones, because they always throw their fire at us, and they've never done that before. Oh, that was awesome. I would have fell down. But, like, they allowed me to, um, do a double jump in midair. And that's also something that you can do in the Sonic Adventure games, which I really like that they brought back. That's, like, my favorite thing to do. So much for me being good at avoiding spike balls. Okay. Let's run over to the other side so we can get to new places. I think we're at the end of the level here. Aw oh, man, I didn't get a cyan whisk. use it here. Yeah, should we use it here? Because I kind of like doing the sidestep on the wall. <laughs> it's fun. There's also a red ring there. So that would have been missed if you had used the cyan wisp. Got 
boxing? Yes. Well, overcompensate much? Man, how many military factories does a guy need? If you weren't always destroying them, I wouldn't need so many. <laughs> yeah, thanks for fixing me. No problem. Sorry you got stuck with a voice tip. It looks like it was killed by a two-year-old. I think I liked it better when I was trying to destroy you. Yeah, well, humans mutual, egg face. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Before we start destroying each other, let's remember why we're working together. Okay, please remind me. Tails, we need Eggman to shut down his machine. And you don't trust me to do it. What? No! I trust you, Tails. It's just that... No, you don't. You trust Eggman more. Do you know how much that fights? I do trust you, Tails, but the whole world's in danger because I did something stupid. You know how much that bites? Actually, nothing bites more. The emotion is strong in this cutscene. That's all I can say. You bite! <laughs> he just got told. Big time. Alright, now there's this level. That's pretty typical in women. <laughs> no offense to any women that are watching this video. This game enhances. Well, it encourages stereotypes about women and fat people. <laughs> Anyways, in this level, we have to control a snowball. And it's kind of annoying because it's kind of hard to control. And I don't like it very much. Any you ring to collect, they'll just snick to. Not snick, but they'll stick to the snowball. And whenever you hit a checkpoint, then you will get them. And if you push all those pool balls in their holes, then you'll get your red ring. And I apparently missed them, so I get no red ring. And it's very annoying when you're trying to collect all of them, because if you... If you, like, miss them and then you don't die, and then you hit the checkpoint, then that's gonna be very annoying for you. I'm really glad I decided not to get all the red rings. And there are these bouncy yetis, I guess they are. They're bouncy, and annoying. And they're bombs. We don't like bombs, guys. Because bombs, they explode and they'll make us all bumpy. Yeah, it's kind of like that one level in that one thing in Super Mario Galaxy where you're on top of that ball. Oh dang. We just blew him away. Literally. But you're never gonna get close to me, blue boy. Oh yeah, by the way, the the Zeddy that we're fighting in this world is Zina. And that's chickens, man. Oh. oh no! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about here. Uh. Oh no, no, no. Uh. No, why do I keep spin dashing? No, I'm not gonna spin dash no more. I just need to take it patiently and slowly. Because if I don't, then I'll go insane. I don't want to go insane, because that would be pretty bad for life. Alright, now I feel it's safe to spin dash. No, it's not. <laughs> oh heck, never mind what I said, because that's all dumb. Good. I don't hit 
let these bombs jump over them. And awesome. Yeah. Should be a checkpoint up ahead, please. Uh, no. Aw, oh, what? Okay, here we are. Yeah, I'm not going that way, because that guy's gonna kill me with his stupid missile. What a friggin' bastard. Ugh, it was... Finally, a checkpoint. Alright, now if you want that red ring over there, you can spin dash into this guy. And... Oh, lordy. And then it'll make him die. But it bounced me too far back, so I apparently missed my opportunity. Wow, I got that in one try. You know, when I'm not under pressure that I have to do something, I apparently do it better. Mm. Oh my god. Like that red ring, like. I was actually trying to get it when I was playing the game in my own time. Or, like, when I was trying to collect all the red rings. Like, I had so much trouble getting that. boss right here. Why did it take so long oh, to fall? Alright. Basically, she's got snowmen, and you want to hit the right one because she's inside of it. And then you go and you hit her. Like, bam. Actually, you have to hit all the snowmen, but don't hit the ones with the bombs on them, because then you'll have to start over. And you don't want to start over. That's no good. <laughs> Alright. Aw, oh, dang it. Okay, I'm gonna keep rolling around here. Okay, well, I should stop rolling then, apparently. Alright. Looks like they're all in a straight line. Let's do this. Awesome. Bam! You're dead. I will not call you because I don't know your phone number, girl. Not that it would anyway. Because you're an animal. That's bestiality. That was that awesome. Was cool. Pun entirely intended. <laughs> Your efforts are impressive, little hedgehog. But you are destined to fail as the battle has failed before you. Eating your black hearts, you headband wannabes! Whoa! Whoa. Your threats are almost as amusing as your mustache. I must commend you on your invention, though. We get stronger and stronger as we leech the life from your dying world. Yeah, I've noticed. Where are you gonna live when your world's dead, guys? Alright, you've been dead too! <laughs> I will burn your worlds, you rebellious scum! I will destroy everything you love and make you rot! Come! 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 
Oh man, that's violent. You know, we should be able to play the Eggman on foot. Because, have you guys ever seen how he plays in Silly like Adventure 2 when he's not in his uh, mech? <laughs> That's fast, man. Um, anyways, we're going into Zone 3. I think we can make it before it uh, exceeds 30 minutes. Hopefully. Alright, now. We kind of get into the factory part of this level. And we're in a casino. It's pretty cool. If you collect these little white ships, um, you can, like, exchange them for a score. I remember watching, uh, something, like, I'm not sure what it was exactly, but yeah, there was this guy who was, like, explaining how the game works. It was probably E3. Uh, from 2013. Maybe not. There's a lot of points. And yeah. And now we are in a pinball section. Which, I don't like pinball sections very much. It's not my games. But it's still a nice throwback. Reminds me of my Sonic Adventure days. Oh, right. Okay, I forgot that I'm supposed to use the ZL and ZR buttons. <laughs> and I still fell. Isn't that something? Ugh. Come on now. Alright, what we're trying to do is actually uh, get enough points so we can get inside that little pod looking thing there. So we can enter the next area of the level. Ah, pinball annoys me. Ever since I played Sonic CD. All right, there we go. Ow. Okay, I don't like how those electric things just like appear out of nowhere. It's a little annoying. More Sonic Rider sound effects. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> I love those Sonic Rider sound effects, they're the best. Alright, another pinball section here. Um, I don't think we have to get a certain amount of score, I think we just have to reach the top. Now, it's kind of hard to do. Oh, jackpot. Oh, yes. I love it. Wow, I am lucky. Now, let's hope I don't get an egg man and have him take all of my friggin' rings away. Because that really makes me mad when that happens. I'm so terrible at pinball. Oh, uh, yes, more. Alright. Going smoothly? Oh, man. Okay, that's nice. Okay, so it looks like Tails gives us more rings than Sonic does. That's kind of strange. It's not like Tails is more valuable than Sonic. That's kind of bullcrap. <laughs> oh, come on. Jeez. You might want to excuse me for a minute here. Oh my god. 
Oh, this is fucking mean. Ah. Okay, so I apparently hit a, um, like one of those power-ups on accident. Like one of those power-ups that you get from dying five times. And it took me away from that section. Like, I literally couldn't get past it. I mean, I didn't mean to hit that thing, but I... But at least I don't have to deal with that anymore. I took more than... More than three minutes just doing that. Uh. Yeah, I hate this level now. I really do. Let's get the heck out of here. This uh, question mark level appeared in Tropical Coast, so I should check that out. Because I did a uh, circus level. Oh no, it's this level. Uh, okay. So, uh, this level you're basically going through this guy. And if you hold the A button, you go down. I don't know why, but it's a really weird concept. I'm not too fond of it. I don't know, but hey, whatever. <sighs> oh, like, can we kill enemies with our rollingness? Yes, we can. But it's only one enemy, or one flicky. So it wouldn't be much use to us. But uh, if you fall down, or fall up or fall down, then you will die. And it kinda sucks. Oh my god. Alright. in here? Seems like we are. Oh god. We have to defeat this thing, I think. I mean not. Let's just not die. Whoa. I like that tail. It looks all silvery. And like, I can see like the really distinct details on that thing. That's awesome. We still don't have enough flickies, however. But I can probably get some more. From a circus level. Okay, I unlocked it. That's good. I didn't, I'm glad I didn't have to, like, do a whole bunch of crap just to unlock this level. Yes, I can finally continue. Move it or lose it, Snow Cone. I don't now see any like art. Like a whole new cup. Oh my gosh, are you serious? I am so, so sorry. Oh, in that case. Oh no, what I meant to say is, I'm so sorry that you have nothing more important to do in life. <laughs> You're gonna pay for that. sucks because we can't double jump either. Ouch. Jeez, man. Oh, we're like a sweater when we go on those speed boosty thingies. <laughs> oh, 
how you can even break ice with their jumps. Or graceful jumps. Awesome. You know, whenever I get in a bad mood from video games, I can get out of it pretty quickly. Like, I've forgotten all about the the Frozen Factory Act 3 business. All I want to do is but here comes that cash that is our hedgehog. I mean, those shoes are atrocious, and the white gloves are ridiculously retro. Hey, Sonic is a pretty retro guy. So... Nah. <laughs> Man, we are ice skating like a master. Ouch. Well, not really anymore. Ah, don't kill me. Uh, thank you. Alright. Um, how do I destroy these? Spin dash, cool. Ooh, that oil. That's, that's kind of nasty. Gross. No! This ice slowed me down. Who would have thought? Ah, isn't ice supposed to make you slip and slide and make you go faster? But no. It does the opposite. Because that makes no sense. Hey, we were just sticking on the wall. What? I'm really confused right now. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. And my battery's low. We don't want We are experiencing very dangerousness right now. Oh yeah. Alright. Screw those balls. They can't get me. Because we are ballsy. Now this is a pretty nice level. I should speed run it, but I won't because I think I would screw up a lot. And also, there's a boss at the end. Oh. Oh, whoa. There are these things from Metropolis Zone again. That's really nice. Spin Dash. I think, I think we can stop our Spin Dash whenever we want to. So we don't have to worry about stuff. Oh, whoa. Why is it not going up? You know what? I don't even care anymore. I'm just gonna run. That's what we do best. Isn't that right, Sunic? Alright. Should be at the boss now. I honestly can't remember what it was, because I haven't played this level in so long. A lot of shooty, uh, sections of this level. Ouch. Huh, I feel like Rayman in the first game when we're going through, uh, the candy level. Hey. Oh, jeez, what? Oh my god, I'm gonna die here. Get out of here, Sonic. Get out of here. Run. Alright. Oh, come on, that was so slow. I could have gotten that. Yes, I would hit a lady, so die. <laughs> wow, she's 
here I've only I hope my battery doesn't die right now. It's a 1%. I can't feel my legs. Put it in the crab. It'll be a crab I man. I think I know a way to cause the lost hex to explode using non-gravity effects. We can destroy the city in one quick stroke. And exterminate every living thing around them. Are you out of your mind? Of course, there'd be some collateral damage. But... Collateral damage? What kind of monster tails? Oh, jeez. <laughs> I suddenly felt very mean. Not the best idea to put the dimwit's head on a battle bot. In hindsight, I gotta agree with you, Doc. Thanks for saying. Um, can you get off me now? <laughs> I figure you out. One Ain't second, you you're like one of your friends, Jig Mans. And the next, you're saving one of your worst enemies. I'm a complicated guy. And you? What were you thinking, Tails? You could have gotten yourself killed. I was just trying to help. All right, that wraps it up for Frozen Factory. Next time we're going to be getting to Silent Forest. Anyways, thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to both comment and like, share the video, and even subscribe, and I'll see you later.